Hanging in a small Italian restaurant in northern Staten Island is the work of photographer Anka Michelson, funded by a grant from the Council for Arts and Humanities for Staten Island. The series, entitled Midnight Churches, is made up of 12 shots of church interiors, taken at night with no lights on. The idea to do or photograph churches at night evolved from pictures that I did a couple years ago, and I took uh, pictures of the rooms in our house at night in the dark with all the lights illuminated, uh, turned off. The Vasali photographs were just amazing. I was like stumped. I thought it'd be great to do it on a larger scale, like to photograph larger spaces. The windows played an important role because, um, well, for one thing, they are the light source, or they were the light source uh, from available light outside of the house, uh, such as street lights. They would, you know, stream in through the window and illuminate the room. And each room has a different color hue. It's the light that you get through these time exposures. It's a very, um, very even light. And all these different elements in a church are like brought out in a very subtle way. Halos uh, around some of the figures are glowing, even though there's such little light. You know, they have like a the quality of a painting almost. So, um, yeah, so just the combination of all these different elements, you know, I just, you know, I was in love with the idea of photographing the churches at night. She captured these interiors by exposing the film and cameras between one and three hours. The photographs are a definite play on the notion of time. While the subject matter is old and familiar, the scene presented to the viewer is new and cannot be seen when standing in the same church. And, because of the exposure time, you are not just seeing one moment, but a series of moments layered onto one image. When you take a picture in, in daytime or with the lights on, everything is just there. These pictures, you, you, you always have to take the time and look at it. It definitely brings out certain things that you wouldn't see um, in a, you know, like lit shot, like, you know, in a photograph that was taken with, with the lights on. Maybe they look at it as ordinary because they see them all the time or they go every Sunday. So it's not, I wanted to really try and show them like something, you know, extraordinary within the ordinary. Michelson's work can be seen at Marie's Gourmet, located on Victory Boulevard in Staten Island, where her husband Brian is part owner. She says her work reflects her love for the old fashioned. It is a renewed look at the past in both content and technique. For the New York City News Service, I'm Emily Meyer.